guys welcome back to my channel and for today's video i have a updated what's in my diaper bag for you guys last time i made this video it was before ollie was even here now he is almost a year old and i figured it was time to share what is actually in my diaper bag nowadays. This is gonna be very realistic. I did not go through this. I have no idea what's in it right now and this could be an absolute disaster, but I figured why not be real with you guys and actually show you genuinely what I have in my diaper bag. We just went out yesterday, so it is stocked with whatever things I thought we would need yesterday. So I hope you guys are excited. I will be doing this video again once baby number two is here. That way you guys know what I have in my diaper bag for two kids, I'm two under two, so that would be really fun. I will have my diaper bag linked down below for you guys. I am obsessed with it. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos and let's get into it. As I said, I did this video already and that was actually with a different diaper bag. I now have this diaper bag. This is the Lula Babe diaper bag. I'm in there's a petite version and then the regular version. I have the regular version. I believe this is the latte brown color, I think. Don't quote me on that. I'm not 100% sure, but I'm absolutely obsessed with this. Love it so much. I actually got the travel bag for my hospital bag and pink for me, obviously. I am having another boy, but it's my hospital bag and I wanted it to be pink, so I got pink, but this is my diaper bag and let me just show you everything. The thing I love most about this diaper bag is all the pockets that it has. So it has this front zip pocket right here. I currently, oh, I just zipped it up. I don't think there's anything in here right now except a pregnancy test and Zofran. Um, yeah, I usually have my wallet in here too, but that is currently downstairs. And then it also has two side pockets, which are currently filled with chapstick, Tums, Tylenol, receipts. So that's what's in the outside pockets. The bag also comes with shoulder straps, which I forgot to grab out of the office to show you guys. Don't currently have that on there now because I love the backpack aspect of it other than the shoulder bag. We're gonna go ahead and open it up for you guys and this is the disaster of my diaper bag. Let's go through it. I'm gonna show you guys everything and then I'll show you what the diaper bag looks like once it's empty. That way you guys get a idea of what the diaper bag looks like on the inside. So the first thing I have in here is, if this is not my life in a nutshell, open puffs because we went out to eat yesterday and I always bring these just in case he doesn't want the things at the restaurant. Like I said, I'm just gonna grab out of it. So whatever I grab, I'll just share. The next thing is obviously baby wipes. Who doesn't need baby wipes when they go out with a baby? Um, you never know what's gonna happen. The next thing, we have a little toy in here. This is the mushroom teether. Um, I got it off of Amazon, but they currently don't have this online anymore because of that like scandal thing that wasn't about this one. They thought it was about this one and took this one down, but it was actually a different one. But he loves this one. We have it in two colors. I'm so happy that I grabbed it before they took it off. The next things I have in here are teethers. I don't know where the rest of them are, but I think I have more in there. Um, these are crushed currently. So we have a mango raspberry teether that's crushed, a banana peach one that's not crushed, and a blueberry purple carrot one that's not crushed as well. I also have um, these vanilla melts banana vanilla melts in here for a snack for him. I have a bunch of different snack options for him because again, you never know when you're gonna need a snack when you're out with your baby. Um, and baby, I mean, I guess toddler technically now since he's almost a year old, which makes me wanna cry saying that. But again, I have so many snacks for him and usually one or two bottles with us just in case. Next thing I have is this beautiful formula holder dispenser thingy travel thing i fill this obviously with formula it comes with its own little scooper but i actually switched that scooper out with the one that our formula came with because this scooper wasn't equivalent to the one that we have it was like a one scoop instead of a two scoop so it was just easier for me to switch it out so i do have this <sighs> story of my life I do have this in there as well. Again, I have a bunch of toys in here for him. So let me grab you like what the toys that I can see at the moment are. 
we have a little person um these are the little people um people little people people he came with a, a recycle truck which is currently downstairs i couldn't find him turns out he was in the depths of my diaper bag i have this little people accessory thing i have this i got from love every i think it was a love every box he chews on this we have multiple of his favorite teething sticks. Most of these are linked on my Amazon storefront for you guys. If you are interested in anything that you see here, most of it is on my Amazon storefront, but these especially I have on there. He has been obsessed with these since he started using teether toys. I don't even remember when that was, but we've gone through so many of these because we've lost a bunch of them. But again, obsessed with these. His Forky is in there and I think Oh, we have another, another one. And I think that's it for the toys. The next thing is a pouch. I actually haven't used or he hasn't eaten like a fruit pouch or like a puree pouch in quite some time. He eats mostly table food now. And of course the occasional bottle here and there um, throughout the day, he does have like three or four bottles throughout the day still. So don't worry, but I do keep this in the diaper bag just in case we're out and he doesn't want any other snack that I have for him. I can always offer this to him and see if this is what he wanted. He's really not as interested in these as he used to be because obviously he's gotten the taste of the real good stuff. So this to him is like, why are you giving me this? But again, I, I'll have this in there just in case he wants it one day. The next couple of things I have in here are obviously diapers. Um, don't ask why I have so many because the answer is I honestly have no idea why I have so many in here. They get lost and i just throw more in there because i overfill my diaper bag you're probably not supposed to overfill it but i do so and i just like throw a whole bunch of stuff in here i need to organize it because then i would be able to find things better obviously because it's a great diaper bag and has great organization i just don't have organization skills so i gotta do that but i have a bunch of diapers because occasionally we would go to my parents house all the time um especially in the summertime when i was borrowing my in-laws car to be there all the time and they don't have his size diapers so i always brought extra with me i'm about to take half of these out and put them away and only keep half of them in there because this is a ridiculous amount of diapers i'm gonna apologize for the lighting if it keeps changing it keeps changing outside so um it keeps changing in here obviously but um okay so the next thing we have in here is desitin desitin that is actually my downstairs desitin and i have an upstairs desitin but we were going somewhere i think we we're going to my parents house or something and he had a little bit of a rash going on so i brought this and i'm kind of just going to keep it in my diaper bag now okay we are getting to the bottom of my diaper bag i promise um the next thing we have in here is an empty teether wrapper another cracked teether um thing going on and then we have mommy's snacks so if you don't know you probably do i'm pregnant i need snacks and if we're out for a really long time shopping and i don't have snack with me i will get really sick dizzy nauseous all the fun stuff that a pregnant woman goes through so i have snacks in here for me as well i have a chewy granola bar um halloween edition of course because it's halloween time and then i also have the halloween shaped pretzels from Utz because these are my favorite and obviously they're only coming out during the holiday season so I have these in there for me okay so now we have my first Halloween onesie I think this is just in there just in case he had a little accident I don't think it's a dirty one so I have a onesie in there for him I also have sunscreen I don't use it and have never used it um only at Disney have we used it and that is why it is in my bag um, and it's been in my bag since May. So I haven't used it since Disney, but that is in there. We have a dry baby wipe, a nunny, another nunny, another nunny. I think that's all the nunnies. And then we have the um, face sunscreen because this is what we used on his face in Disney. And then we have a plastic spoon because this is actually a toy to him. I know. I have a fork because I brought 
food to my parents house while I was eating it in the, their car and I brought a fork from home and I wanted my fork back so I put my diaper back so I forgot this was in there this was like three weeks ago the next things I have is this lid to nothing in here and this cap to nothing in here as well also we are at the bottom full of puffs if you can see it is completely covered in puffs let me show you what i have in the pockets there are actually five pockets so there's pockets all along let me see if i can do this in an efficient way all along this bag right here and then there's obviously the zip pocket on this side so let me share with you what i have in the pockets so let's go through our first pocket. We have hand sanitizer for me, not for him, obviously. We have a apple pumpkin cinnamon puree, which I don't know how long it's been in there, so that'll be in the garbage. We also have more Tylenol, because I guess I forgot I put that Tylenol in there. More chapstick and more chapstick covered in puff dust. In the next pockets, we have this oral pain relief nighttime. This is something that I used occasionally when he was teething. Um, I did not use this all the time. I think I've used it twice and I don't really know if it worked or not, but I have it in my diaper bag. We have allergy relief, which obviously I'm not taking because I'm pregnant, but this was in here for I don't even remember why. We also have another teether stick. I'm telling you guys, these are important to us. We also have a nunny that he has not used in forever because he doesn't like these. We also have a pair of socks and another dried up baby wipe. The next pocket, we have the daytime oral stuff. His sunglasses that I got for Disney. He never wore them. Also have this hand sanitizer for babies. I've never used it, but I bought it. And then we have Origel for babies when he was teething. I used that maybe twice. Again, don't know if that made a difference or not. So I never really used it. Cause I was like, I can't really tell if this is working. So we didn't use that. But the last pocket has nothing in it. Um, but the zipper pocket is my pocket. And when I had a period, because obviously again, I'm pregnant, so I don't have one now. I would have to wear a diaper instead of a pad or a tampon because my periods after having Ollie have been really, really heavy, like extremely heavy. Like I've never experienced a period this like that in my entire life, heavy. So I have a diaper for me. So not only do I have a diaper for my son, I have a diaper for myself. So gotta love it. Gotta love being a mom. And that is everything in my diaper bag. My diaper bag is, well, I put everything back in their pockets because I'm going to go through this later today and actually clean it out. And I have to go through and actually clean out all the puffs that fell into the diaper bag. But this is my diaper bag empty. It is so amazing. I am obsessed with it. It's actually my favorite diaper bag ever. Like I said, I did have a different one before this one. It was also a backpack one, but I did not find it as convenient as this one. I feel like I find everything that I need so much easier and so much faster in this one and I can't wait to use it for both the boys and see how it works with two babies so I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to give it a big thumbs up comment down below if you have the sniper bag or if you're going to buy one again it is linked down below for you guys definitely go check it out and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos I love you guys and I'll see you in the next one bye